Hi guys, hope you're well. Uh, my partner Yvette, the lovely Yvette, has got her own YouTube channel, Yvette Rowland, and uh, this week she did an interview, fascinating interview, with uh, Lenny McLean's daughter, Kelly McLean. It's all about her dad, mental health issues and bullying, so it's well worth a watch. So uh, I'm going to show you some clips now, but if you fancy watching the whole interview, just click on the link in the description below. Cheers. Till I got a little bit older, realised that obviously he had an aggressive side. Mm -hmm. But obviously the fun stuff was fantastic. I mean, we had holidays, we had a brand new car every month. You know, they give us what we wanted. Yeah. So that side of it was good. But obviously, when it, you you know you knew as soon as you stepped foot indoors, it was mm -hmm. just like a black cloud indoors. When he used to scream, it was literally. Um, unbearable because I think I fell out with the whole of the East End because of my aggression and a quick right. tempered. Sometimes my brain is rushing so much I can't handle noise around me. Right. I'd look down at my fingers, they're covered in blood, there's blood all in the sink. I tried to take my own life before the girls was here. I yeah. tried to take my own life. I self armed one, my girls needed me the most, right. so I won't make that mistake again. And believe it or not, I'm getting bullied. Can't say where, yeah. can't say who, mm -hmm. but I'm actually getting bullied by two people, but it's mental bullying. I am actually doing a boxing match in April. I mean, they can feel free to get in the ring with me if they want. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure I'll show them a trick or two. I mean, they want to call my dad a bully. My dad was 21 stone and muscle. He got in the ring with men twice his size. I don't call that a bully. I call them people bullies. You know, my dad loved Christmas. Mm -hmm. He was like a big kid. So my mum would do all the table all around there. And I suppose that was my best memory because we're all laughing and joking. Mm -hmm. And if you drop something on the floor and happen to pick it up and look under the table, we all had pyjamas on. So we all had nice tops on for me. That was all not glamorous. When you looked under the table, there's my dad sitting there with his pants. It's me in pyjama bottoms and my mum. If you were given a moment back in time and you could talk to your dad again, what would you say to him? Sorry. No, that's all right. Um, I'd probably say that I'm sorry for the way that I looked at you, that other people look at you. Um, you know, and I know he struggled in life like me, so I'm probably sorry. Yeah. I think it's a I'm sure he knows. So, yeah, yeah. yeah, don't get me wrong, we've had them days we walk on eggshells, but we've also had them wonderful days. And obviously, you know why he was ill, we see the real Lady McLean. <laughs>